We expect children to start walking any time between 9 months and all the way to 18 months. It's a very broad spectrum and lots of children start walking on their 12th month birthday, their first birthday, which obviously is very special. If a child starts walking earlier, that's fine, and if a child starts walking later than that, that's also fine. If you have any concerns, speak to your health professional. Getting your baby to walk is one of the great things about parenting and the simple things help. Go at their baby's pace, don't encourage it, it's not a competition and babies will walk at their own pace and that's a very important part of this campaign that's been sponsored by Start Right. So make sure you've got some push-along toys, lots of babies get for their first birthday, push-along toy, that's great, toys they can go and grab and just enjoy the process, it's a lot of fun. Your child is ready for their first proper shoes when they're walking unaided and their feet need protection. It's a good idea to look at the campaign website, healthylittlefeet.com. It's got a very useful ready for shoes reckoner. And then take them to the shoe shop, get your child's foot properly measured and get some proper shoes on them. When you go to buy your child's first shoes, it can be a very exciting time. And do take advice from the professional shoe fitters. Go to a shoe shop, get your child's foot properly measured, it's very important. They do vary from in the width fitting and that pair of shoes is important. Do look at the healthylittlefeet.com checklist if you've got concerns as to what to expect. And what you're looking for in a well-made children's shoe like Start Right, I've got one here, is a shoe that's fastened on. It must always be fastened on, no slip-on shoes for the babies, their feet are too immature. You're looking for a shoe that's not overly flexible so that it doesn't bend up and curl up like a ball. And you're looking for a shoe that's got a nice stable heel cup. And then don't forget to get your feet measured regularly because children's feet grow very fast. I'm supporting the Healthy Little Feet campaign because I work as a podiatrist, as a foot specialist and in my day-to-day -day clinical practice I see adults who've got long-term foot damage often by wearing ill-fitting shoes as children and we know the importance of properly measured, properly fitted children's shoes and that's why I'm working with Start Right on guiding people to this website healthylittlefeet.com. There's some great advice on there and of course as a mother of three I've had personal experience now at getting children's feet measured and properly fitted and it is a learning curve and you do need to go armed with information as is my child ready for shoes, what type of shoe am I going to buy and it's very important to have some good advice out there so I'm really delighted to support this campaign. For more information about your child's foot health then do speak to your health professional. We make a team, the doctor, the podiatrist, the health visitor. For further information look at the healthylittlefeet.com website. It's a campaign website with lots of information about your baby's feet and development and can be very useful to you.